Hello all, welcome to Autobot YouTube channel. Myself Rahul Krishna. Today we are going to see one of the uh, activity that is available in UI path that helps to find out what is the name of the execution file as well as just consider you need to understand what is the name of the process or you have to uh, see like which robot is executing your process. Right? So this kind of data in few of the situation you may need to require right like which automation process or the file is executing now, right or if you have multiple robots that is assigned for executing multiple job and you need to understand which robot is executing your process at this particular time right so this uh, kind of requirement can be uh, meet with an activity in uipa that is get job status activity okay so let me search with get okay yeah so the name of the activity is get the current job info okay so that is the name of the activity so let me drag and drop this activity okay so as i mentioned earlier i'm just hovering on top of this okay so uh, i'm just going through the description that ui path is providing for this activity okay it provides runtime job info such as process name and version and workflow name robot name and mode of execution okay so all these details can be achieved using get current job info Okay, so just consider you have some uh, two or three versions of process that has already uploaded and you want to cross check like which version of the process is executing now. How you can do that? You can directly use this get job info activity. Okay, otherwise what we have to do, you will have to go with the uh, orchestrate APIs and you will have to get all these uh, details or the robot activities you can use, sorry, robot API you can use for getting this detail. But it, it will be some uh, today's work. Instead of that, you can directly use this uh, default activity in UI. Okay. So I will show you uh, how this will be helpful for getting the details. So I just drag and drop this activity and let me go to properties. Okay. Here we have only one job data, right? So let me hover on top of this. So what this output will give? Job uh, contains job info such as process name and version, workflow name robot name and mode of execution okay so what i'm going to do is let me create a variable here okay jb data where okay job data where i put it like a job data where okay so let me rename this job data where and it is a variable type current job info okay so that also you have to keep in mind the variable type is current job info so now what i'm going to do is let me use a right line activity okay we use the right line activity and what is the variable that we have created jb data var right so let me use that click on dot okay and here you will get the attribute that you can use okay so it is providing picture picture mode or process name or process version robot name and workflow name so if you're going with workflow me uh, workflow name means it will show you like which workflow is executing now okay so here you can see uh, the my workflow name is job status activity right and we have one more uh, activity called me sorry one more workflow called me but if you want to get uh, the name of the current executing workflow i can go with the workflow name okay so i'm just using that let me duplicate this activity okay uh, let me go with robot name okay so before do this let me add a string as well robot name is okay and here also let me add workflow name is okay let me drag and drop this what is the next parameter that is available it is process version okay so it will give you what is the version of the process okay so i'm just going with the process name process version is okay and here let me duplicate this for getting the okay, process version is and here i'm going to use process name as well okay i need to get the name of the process what is the process name it's all about demo okay it's a process name that's it okay so process name is process name 
process. Okay, so uh, what are things that we are going to get? We are going to get the name of the process that is auto code demo, and we are going to get the name of workflow that is job status activity, and the name of the robot, and uh, the name of the version version name as well. We are going to get. So this will be helpful. Like uh, um, just consider you want to troubleshoot like uh, uh, some issue happened uh, or happening while you're executing your process using some some particular uh, particular robot okay so during troubleshooting you want to understand okay which robot is executing that process okay then you can use this particular um, uh, attribute okay or just consider you want to easily understand during which uh, workflow uh, inside which workflow the failure is happening okay then you can use this uh, workflow parameter right so like this way it will help you for the troubleshooting of getting the details about the current job that is executed okay so let me execute this and let's see the output that it is generating okay Okay, so let me go to output. Okay, here you can see process name is auto put demo, right? And workflow name is job status activity. And robot name is this is my robot name right? that is of mode attended, right? And what is the process version? Process version is 1.0.2, uh, right? So all these details got I started using the get current job info activity. Okay, I hope you find this video useful. If you like the video, please. Uh, uh give your comments valuable comments and uh, don't forget to share with your friends okay so i'll uh, see you soon with a new uh, video thanks thanks for watching